Well, I'm our facts of Mars, and President Trump is just taking a pin to the old we mogul weather balloon story as it relates to the uh, Roswell crash in 1947. In 1947, I think it was July 4th, if I'm not mistaken, a farm hand or rancher or whatever uh, named Mac Brazel found debris on his ranch and the debris didn't look like anything you'd ever seen. From that, and there's a whole bunch of other stuff that I'm not going to get into, but basically the government years later said it was this uh, classifi classified project called Project Mogul, which is where they used weather balloon. Back then, at the time, they called it a weather balloon, too. So, basically, they said it was a weather balloon then, and then later on they came out with a mogul story saying it was a weather balloon. Now, most of us don't believe that. Uh, but President Trump has just taken a pin to that old weather balloon story. Because uh, he was in an interview with his uh, son, Don Jr., and he said they had some very interesting things about Roswell, and Trump Jr. asked him, if he might declassify that information someday. Well, we'll have to think about that one, the president responded. Trump also divulged and he watched a couple episodes of Netflix, Tiger King. I don't want to hear this. Basically, though, what this does is it takes a pin to the old weather balloon story because Project Mogul is no longer classified. So he can talk about it openly without any repercussions. Other than the uh, press getting at him for one thing after another. But, I mean, he's used to that. So President Trump has basically just taken a pin to the weather balloon story. I wish he would declassify it, uh, as do many others. Meantime... Uh, President Trump, have a good Father's Day, and keep on rolling toward re-election. I'm on a fax of Mars.